Coach Gordon, EWLs, first things first, much improved Bloomsbury Husky team. A healthier team, it looks like it probably is. Healthier team, a uh, little bit a little bit older. You know, last year we started eight freshmen out of ten weights. This year uh, there must be six freshmen or so out of the out of ten. So uh, we're definitely definitely a little older, uh, moving in the right direction, but uh, still have a way to go. 133, you got a finalist, right? Correct. Yes. So, I mean, there's obviously with Schultz, he had a big win over Suffalo. There's yeah. only one bit at that weight, though. Yes, yes. So, so what's, you know, you, hey, it's a do or die tonight. What's, what's the, what are you telling Schultz? What do you guys got to do to get an uh, EWL title back home? The main thing is go out there and wrestle. Wrestle. I mean, uh, you see, uh, we revenged the loss against Cephalo. Um, from earlier in the year, um, when me- mostly it was because he went out there and was aggressive. Whenever he's off offensive and attacking, he's uh, he's scoring points and wins a lot of matches. I mean, he's 20, 22, 24, 25, and six, whatever it is this year. So obviously he can he can win. Seeing the improvement that you guys have seen this year, you won some duels that you didn't win in the past. This year you changed some results up. How many duels did you guys win this uh, year? We won six. So won we won uh, six duels. First, it was, uh, no, we won two EWL wins uh, this year, and that was the first time since 2014 that we've won a EWL uh, duel, so that was nice. Uh, uh, we had two Division One wins last year, four total, but only two Division One. Uh, this year we're at six, you know, so we're just going in the right direction. How does it feel to know that, like, the fruits of your labor, the recruiting, what you guys are doing in the room, guys academically, how does it feel like yeah, you always going want the right more. direction, right? <laughs> You're going in the right direction, but you always want more. You know, um, uh, the guys are buying into the program. That's the biggest thing. You know, uh, when it, once the guys start um, believing in everything you're doing, um, they, they start winning. Uh, other guys are excited for them. They see one guy's doing the right things in the room, in the weight, in the weight room, in the classroom, with their social life, you name it. So it just builds the culture. And uh, so it's taking, taking time, but uh, going in the right direction. You're not going to be wrestling second, second at 133 in the finals tonight. The order's all jumbled up. Do you like that order? Uh, it, I think it uh, doesn't make a difference. I think, you know, with, with Andy Schutz, he's a kid that's a senior. He he knows what it takes to win. So uh, he's going to, you know, spend a little little time in the back with his feet kicked up and uh, start warming up a little bit later and get ready to scrap. How do you replace guys like that? Uh, uh, he's going to be a tough one to replace. You know, he's, uh, uh, he's a guy that I wish we had for a couple more years. You know, he's um, really, this is the first year that he's had a winning record. You Are you know? serious? Uh, yeah. So as a senior, yeah. So he's a uh, you know, he's a uh, he's a guy that you know. I hope some of our young guys uh, that maybe didn't win as many matches as what they hoped to this year. Hopefully, they can look at him and you know see that if you if you do what he does day in day out, because uh, he's a great guy in all in all areas of life. You know, and uh, it's paying off for him this year. You know, so hopefully we get out there and, and get that get the W here in the finals. If if not, I mean uh, he's sitting right there right there uh, for a possible um, Matt large bit so I'm uh yeah well good luck to you guys tonight you got anything else for me that's it hey thanks for the time keep improving we'll see you guys down the road and good luck thank you